Hey everybody, it's Steve. This is going to be a quick review of the Samsung Gear VR. Now, I got this unit today. I got it at um, Target and got it at a good price. Well, the typical price. It was $99, then with tax, came out to $106. Um, I just have to say, though, that I like the quality of the videos that I watched, some of the demos, music videos, um, action videos. You know, it's really neat. Um, a lot of people, well, I don't want to say a lot, but, you know, quite a re few people who've talked about this have complained about, you know, pixels and pixelization, that when you're watching something, you can see pixels. Um, I didn't really notice it that much. Yeah, once in a while you'll notice it, um, but it's really not too bad. It doesn't take away from the overall experience, which I have to say is really good, the quality of the videos and stuff you watch. is really kind of neat. Um, some of the content is expensive, but, you know, if you like it, you'll buy it. The reason it's going back, though, and it's going back tomorrow, so it'll be less than a day that we had it, is because it's just way too heavy. Now, the unit itself is, you know, fairly light. However, when you put the phone in it, and I have a fairly light phone, mine's done up with my Galaxy Note 5, is it's just too heavy. And so when your phone is inside the unit, it puts a lot of pressure, you know, pulling down on the unit itself, so you'll feel a lot of weight on the bridge of your nose, um, somewhat on the back of your head. Um, and what doesn't help the fact is um, these straps, they're not not—they're adjustable, but not really too, too much. So in my household, I happen to have one of the larger heads because I'm a big guy. So the, the tightness there isn't really that comfortable. But everybody in the house did complain, though, about the weight of the unit with the phone, you know, obviously in it. It's because you need to have your phone in there to look at the VR experience. It's everybody complained about, you know, the weight, the pressure when it's pushing down on the bridge of the nose. So that's something you're wanna, going to want to consider and really, you know, give a lot of thought to, you know, before you, you know, run out of your time to return it, whether it's 14 days at Best Buy or 30 at Target or wherever is that that could be kind of uncomfortable after a while. But let me just say that, you know, the experience of watching the videos and stuff itself was really cool. But like I said, it's going back again because it's just way too heavy. Um, so hopefully at some point Samsung could, you know, fix this. How, I don't know. I mean, because if they do require a phone, it will give that extra weight. But I don't know. So it's a good idea, but I don't know. The execution doesn't work out for us. So anyway, that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, uh, just you know, leave them in the comments below. And thanks for watching.